Hello everyone, greetings from a very cold and snowy Worcester College. And you'll see from the photographs that the college continues to be as beautiful as ever, particularly in the snow. I'd like to pass on our best wishes to all of our old members, whatever you're celebrating, whether it's Hanukkah, Christmas, or just the new year. The new year in particular is a time to reflect on everything we've achieved in the last 12 months and you won't be surprised that Worcester has achieved a great deal. I'm really proud that our students are able to study again, spend time in the library without worrying about COVID. I've also had the opportunity to meet many old members in the course of the last 12 months. I assess that out of our 9,000 active old members, I've probably met about a third of you. That's a lot. And I've met you either in emails, uh, in person, when you've come back into college, or at one of our many events, the wonderful Benefactors Garden Party, the two Gordies that we've held this autumn, and the Diamond and Gold Jubilee lunches. We had a fantastic event at the House of Lords in September. And before that, I was able to spend time with a number of our old members in New York. It was a great opportunity really to hear firsthand about your experiences of coming to Worcester and your deep affection and continuing affection for the college. I'd like to take this opportunity of thanking our staff and fellows for all that they do for Worcester. Our staff, because they contribute hugely to the successful running of the college and for the wonderful work that they do, so much of it behind the scenes, but also to our fellows and other academics who make this place so successful in terms of our education and research and their huge commitment to our students. 18 months in, I realise firsthand how special the college is to everybody who has been educated here. It's my privilege to lead this community, but also to thank you for making it so special and so welcoming to me. And so finally, on behalf of everyone at Worcester, can I wish you and your families a happy festive season. And please remember, you are always welcome to visit Worcester and I look forward to seeing you or corresponding with you in 2023. Thank you.